right now we get the Kajat guest in the house. She is an actress and media entrepreneur. She does actually feature for inside uh, movies like Funke, Unjustified, Contention, The X, Iri Oru, and plenty others. She joined the entertainment industry in 2003 uh, when she and, uh, started with acting. And a few months later, she joined the modeling industry where she do various adverts job um, for inside Yobodo, Nigeria. She don't do plenty of things. Jamie, welcome. Sheu Omojela, good to have you. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. <laughs> so how the, how the act, how acting, Nomi? First of all, what did it lead you into acting, let me ask? Um, when I was in secondary school, I just had this, like, play for acting or stage plays. So I started with the drama, you know, club in the school, and I was just like, you know what? Let me just find out how to do this thing. Then um, there was this place in Surule at the time called Winnie's. So I went there and, you know, just to network and meet some other people. And eventually I was told that, okay, if I really want to join this thing, I need to join um, Actors Guild of mm -hmm. Nigeria. I need to register, which I did. Then afterwards, I met some friends. They usually tell me when there is an audition. Then you go for the audition, then you go back to check on the wall to see if you're yeah. picked or something. <laughs> so that's how I started. Yeah. Yes. And how has the journey been so far? Because we don't get a lot of actresses come out and say, hey, it's not easy being mm -hmm. auditioned and even getting the role. You know, easy. You know, easy. That's the truth. You have to like, probably go back and forth to see. Like, sometimes you go for auditions, you keep going for auditions, and they're not picking you, and you're like, is it that I'm not good enough? What is going on? But... Um, if you believe in yourself or something, like you, you know you really want this, then you won't definitely um, give up. Um, honestly, it's not easy to, from the producers to the marketers to some people seeing you like, okay, maybe you're pretty and they want to like, you know, before they give you a role, they have to probably date you or That's something. That's why I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm telling you. So you have to really know who you are and, mm. um, you know, definitely, if you have the talent, definitely someday somebody is going to discover you and say, you know what, you're good, and I'm really ready to give you a chance, which was def definitely what happened to me. Yes. Now, you know, say, uh, uh, recently we get one particular uh, actor being come and talk, say, Nollywood people, they only show themselves love, uh, acting, and then you go hear people go talk, say, this particular actor don't buy this new Range Rover, this one don't buy this new moto, this new power bike. <laughs> say, where did, they see, where did they see the money? How, how lucrative? Has it been for you, so to speak? For you now, not for the entire, not the entire industry. Just to me, I, I'm mm. not going to lie. I'm not going to say I don't get paid. But sometimes it's not enough. Most especially when you know that, ah, you don't do this thing for, like, for, for a while. And, ah, this is not my word now. But you want to do the job. You're like, ah. You know, sometimes you just sit down at home and you're like, ah, I haven't gotten a job for, like, two months. Now I got this one. Now I want to be sh doing shaka for, mm. you know, for price. So, just, like... To be candid, I'm not going to say it's not lucrative, mm. but in a way, you just need to have something else you're doing. Mm. Probably be another business to support yourself until you get to that point where you know that, okay, now I can live on this acting job. But most times, some people, it takes them decades, even more than before they can actually pay their bills with this thing. So maybe some other actress or some other actors have something else they're doing. It could be like maybe they have another venture. Like I have a production company, I, you know, I produce content and... You know, I do other things like that, like activation and brand management. So from that, I get to like probably, you know, make some money and, you know, support my lifestyle. So some other people, maybe they have something else they're doing as well to no, support themselves. Very, 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 very strong. You talk, say, uh, for the industry, um, you go see some, you go, they run from producer to marketers and even some, from peop some people where go one sleep with you just to give you a role. I just want to know how you take jump and pass this particular one, especially, especially getting a um, uh, request from people to sleep with you just to give you a role. I got a life, I say, I know pass through that. Do you understand? Um, the truth is, some of them, they, they, they know if you're desperate, like you're so desperate to be in a movie, or you're so desperate to like become this superstar and everything because it's fame for some people. Mm -hmm. But if it's for you, like it's about the talent, it's not really like, of course, the, the fame comes with this thing, even if you're a footballer or something. And if you're good, definitely people will definitely know you. But at first, that's not really what you're about. You're really about the talent. You're really about getting the job done and getting good, a good story that would support you in your career. But those people, they get to see you if you are really desperate. And like they just want to take advantage. 
Do you understand? And people are like, oh, there's no sexual harassment and everything. I'm going to say that there is, but you just have to know who you are. If you really know you, you know your person, you don't have to give in to it because eventually you're going to get there. All right, very, very quickly, I want to ask, um, um, you know, anything new we would expect from you? Anything? Uh, yes, I have some things that, uh, in, this is 2019, yes, so yeah. definitely. <laughs> A lot of plans. Yeah, some things coming up. Actually, there is this um, Yoruba series I did, like, a um, um, couple of months back. It's going to come out this year. It's a series, though. It's called, um, it's called ODD. And um, definitely there are other ODD. projects. ODD. 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 ODD, yes. Honestly, I don't even know. Like, my production manager just came. Like, I don't really. There is a word in Yoruba they use for I don't think it has, like, probably English okay, meaning or so. I don't know. ODD. All the Yoruba go behind the scene, ODD. Like, yes, ODD. like, some people can call it ODD. ODD, like, something like that is standing. Mm. Like, like, oh. like, yeah, ODD, like, oh. standing. Yeah. So <laughs> it's coming up very soon. And I have other things that um, we are working on right now, like a short, like, mini series for a web series, you know, like, six episodes. Like, yeah. Yeah. Quickly, quickly <laughs> let me quickly ask you two questions. Yes. Uh, first of all, of all the roles where you don't do, which one would be your most challenging role? That's one. And then two, which role, if you said to be the best role, where we say, even if you sleep, if you don't drink, you they wake, you say, do this role, you go do it to perfection. Hmm. Okay. Right now, the favorite movie for me is still the one I did last year, which I think I played a wife to, a young wife to, um, um, Daddy Jide Kusoko. Mm. And that was really challenging for me because I've never really done like, a young wife like that, and it's really, really nice. Um, I think that's still like the number, like the, the film I right now like think that that's still one of my challenges, um, role. challenging role. Yeah, and for like <laughs> any film, ah, character, character. Uh, yeah, because usually, no, <laughs> usually people like, like, usually, normally I'm a calm person and okay. sometimes I can be very shy and quiet, but the truth of the matter is, but I can like go crazy when it comes to like. Like once they say action and they say I should do like like the serious crazy, mm. do like crazy, crazy and I <laughs> could just Thank do you that. So much, <laughs> you need to Thank watch you, out sir. for her this well, watch out for her this year because she gets lots of projects to keep you entertained uh, for inside the entertainment industry. Wish you all the best and thank, thank you, you so for much for having me. Thank you so much. Actually, if you have not the show today, see you again tomorrow. My name is Women We Ehi Yamusoy. Yeah, and I Bernard Akedimun again lovely, lovely, fabulous weekend ahead. And I'm Shane Omojala. Hey, superstar. <laughs> To enjoy more of these our Ugunke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.